Can you hear me? Okay. I think you can hear me, right? Yes, okay. Now, we are going to start with today's class, okay? And give me one second. Today is Friday, so we're going to do a lot of practice with our book, right? And we are going, to, I am going to be asking you a lot of questions as well, right, about the classes that we saw for the whole week. Voy a estar preguntando hoy de todo lo que vimos la semana. Okay. Oh, my video. Enjoy your meal, Angie. Okay. Let me see. So today is video conferencia. Oh, give me a second. Today is video conferencia numero 10, right? That we're going to practice. And we're going to keep doing vocabulary practice. Let me show you in a moment. <laughs> okay. Good evening, Mr. Palma, Salia. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Okay, so we have video conference number 10, simple practice, simple present practice and daily routines, okay? That is what we have. Okay, there we are. I couldn't hear you. Now, we're going to start with some activities here with this uh, video conference. At this point, we are going to finish unit two today. Okay, that's what we're going to finish today, unit number two. And we're going to go over the objectives for this week. Uh, let's go with objective number one, competencies number one, Angie. Describe. Okay. Describe my job, position, and the activities that I perform every day at work. At work. work. Very good. Number two, Abidail. At work. At work, very good. Okay, perfect. Asalia, go with number three. <laughs> Ask partner question about their daily proteins and hear them. Give them. Uh -huh. and, and hear answer about my routine about my routine very good and number four please help me nelson i love it baby nelson uh question about someone else Daily. Okay. No se escucha, teacher. Yes. Lo escucho claro, loud cortado. and clear. <laughs> again, again, ask partners. Okay. Ask partner question about someone else daily routine and say what they do dumb. They do or don't. Excellent job, Nelson, excellent job. So today we are going to do uh, more practice than yesterday, right? Just let me see one of four. 
Students, ya no van a ayudar a entrar a los centros para conectar. Puede usar el celular, Ileana. No hay ningún problema. Ok. After that commercial, let's continue. No. How are you feeling this Friday? You're feeling good? Or tired? Like, ah, I want to sleep. How are you feeling? ¿Cómo I'm se tired. siente? Tired. tired. Me too. Um, Me too, but it's fine. I think we can make it. Ya van a hacer la tía, ya van a ver. I drink coffee para no dormirme. <laughs> Oof. I have a lot of coffee here with me right now. Like a big cup of coffee to go through the night. Well, let's go ahead and practice. I am going to show you right now one exercise and today we are going to do a lot of practice individually okay individual practice and sometimes we're going to work in a small groups but mostly individual work quiero ver cómo trabajan de forma individual okay quiero ver cuáles son sus respuestas porque a veces entro en los grupos y veo que están así como que we don't know what to do okay so we're going to work individually. Let me show you one exercise. This exercise is from our book, right? And it says here, very easy. Uh, Claudia, can you read the, the instruction? Create yes, no questions using the words in mm. parentheses. Parentheses. Write the answers. Write the answers, very good. So we have number one, two, three, four, five, right? Five different uh, um, questions. And now we are going to put this in order, right? And we are going to say, it says, yes, no questions, okay? We are going to use simple right? What do you think is going to be the question number one? Claudia, what do you think question number one is going to be like? You yeah. work company. Uh, do you work at company? Do you work at the company? Okay, do you work at the company? Very good. What else, is this correct? Claudia? You think? Okay. What is missing? There is something that is missing and it's very important, but it's right here. Do you work at the company? Question mark. Very good. The answer. Asalia, how can you answer this question if it's positive? Affirmative. Asalia? Yes. Do you work at the company, Asalia? Yes. 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 Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Okay. Look at the auxiliary. Yes, I do. I do. Yes, I do. Le voy a dar un tip. Un tip. Miren. Cuando ten... ustedes se van a fijar, todos, todos, se van a fijar en el auxiliar que la pregunta está utilizando, ¿ok? Yes. Con base en el auxiliar que la pregunta está utilizando, esto es para todos, no solo para Salia, con base en el auxiliar que la pregunta está utilizando, ustedes así van a, a utilizar el, auxil, el mismo auxiliar en su respuesta corta, ¿ok? Yes. Por ejemplo, si yo les pregunto a Ricardo, Right. Este es solo ejemplo, está fuera de acá, pero es para que se recuerden. Ricardo, are you a supervisor? Are you a supervisor? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Él está utilizando I am porque acá en la pregunta yes, tenemos me. are. ¿Ya? Yes, I am. Si le pregunto, por ejemplo, eh... 
Si yo les pregunto algo más avanzado, por decir algo. Would you like some coffee? Would you like some coffee? Y la respuesta corta sería yes. Yes, I like. Yes, I would. Very close, very close. Yes, I would. Porque estoy usando would como auxiliar. Pero esto es más avanzado. El, el propósito es que siempre utilicemos el mismo auxiliar de la, de la pregunta en nuestras respuestas cortas. ¿Ok? Ok. Ok, very good. Let's continue. Now, number one is complete. Right? Number one is complete. What about number two? I will give you two minutes to finish. Okay. Let me see who is here. Uy, qué poquitos han venido. Hello, Jennifer. Hello, Angie. Asalia. Hello, teacher. Hello, Claudia. Hello. Emerson. Hi, Emerson. Hi, Eneida. Welcome. Hello. Hi, teacher. <laughs> Ayer se tomó vacación. Leida, eh, hello, Leida. No, estaba algo cansada. Me sentía mal. <laughs> hello, teacher. <laughs> hello. Hello, uh, Nelson. Hi. Hello, teacher. Hi, hi. Hello, Sandra. Sandra, nice to see you, Sandra. Hmm. Se fue con Eneida de party hi, ayer. Good night. Hi, good, good evening. Mr. Palma se fue con la Eneida y con la Sandra. Hi, Mr. Palma. Hi, Ricardo. Alias Richard. Ah, no, Henry le puso la Angie, ¿verdad? Henry le puso. That's my husband's name, so I, that's why I remember. Hi, Nancy. How are you? Otra que fue de parranda ayer. No, estaba enferma. Tenía mm. migraña. Mm. That's why. That's why. Okay. Okay. No worries. No worries. Now, what do you have for this? Oh, in the meantime, while you're working, I'm going to call the attendance. Okay. Mientras hacen eso, yo les paso la asistencia. Así aprovechamos el tiempo. Please uh, say your names. Mm -hmm. Okay, and don't forget to turn on your cameras if you can, please. Let me see here. With the attendance, we go with Angela de Jesus Santa Maria. Presente, teacher. Asalia Melanie Guardado Portillo. Presente, teacher. Claudia Jeanette Ramos Hernández. Present, teacher. David Ernesto Quintanilla Martinez. No, David, no. Emerson Javier Rivera Rojas. Present. Eneida Jasmine Hernández Plus. Present. Francis Humberto Hernández Valle. Francis. Francis. Franco Damián Vázquez. Juan José, Juan Josué Hernández Hernández. Tampoco. Eneida Susana Sorto. Present. Present. Pueden ser de su camarita para ser present, sí. Leida. Pero es que, ah, bueno, solo por un ratito porque voy uh -huh. en el carro. Ah, ok. Es que acabo de salir de trabajar. Hi, Leida. Nice to see you. Hi. Póngala en nuevo, póngala en nuevo. Nancy María Serrano Chacón. Hi, Nancy. Okay. Present, ok, very good. Nelson Brian Pereira Maravilla. Hi there. Norma Carolina Mata de Chévez. Norma Carolina. Pedrina Ileana Gómez. 
Ricardo Gabriel Alvarenga Ventura. Thank you. Thank you, Ricardo. Sandra Gladys Méndez de Barahona. Present teacher. Very good. Thank you so much. Jennifer Avidaí López Escoto. Jennifer. Grite, Jennifer. <laughs> Present. Le entendemos la Daniel Antonio García Cortés. José Alfonso Palma. Present teacher. Hi, hello, Mr. Palma. Okay, that's the attendance. Hi, that's the first time that we call the attendance. Let's see with the next part here. Next, next, next. Okay. Number two. Number two. What do you have for number two, Sandra Gladys? They check product. What's the question? They check the product. Okay, and what is the auxiliary that we use in simple present, Sandra? What? What is the auxiliary that we use in simple present? Do. There, do, okay, very good. Very good, we use do. So what is the question? Do they do? check? Do they check the product? Do they check the product? Okay. And the answer is? No, they don't. No, they don't. Okay. Hmm. Lazy people, right? Araganes. No, they don't. Okay. Very good. Number three, Angie. Okay, teacher. Uh, we. Listen. No. I perdon. Do do we listen? Do we listen? Do we listen? Customer. Okay. Teacher. Yo les dije que había la palabra listen, el verbo listen siempre estaba con un hijito toda la vida. Con un chicle pegado siempre. Listen to. Listen to. To, to the customers. The customers. The customers. Okay. Do we listen to the customers? Yes? Yes, uh, we do. Yes, we do. Excellent job. Yes, okay. yes, we do. Excellent. Now we have number four. I buy new material. I buy new material. What do we do? Okay, let's see Mr. Palma. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hi. Okay. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> um, do. Do. Do I. Do buy? I. Do I buy. Okay. Buy. New material. New material. New. Material. Okay, repeat, material. 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 Very good. No? No, I do. I do, no, I do. No, I don't. No, I don't, exactly, yeah. very good. No, I don't. Emerson, help me with the last one. Good night, teacher. Hi, good night. I'm sorry. Sorry. Hi. Emerson, go with number five. Do Milena and Pablo design logo? Okay. Do Milena, Milena, tu amiga, Milena and Pablo design a logo? Okay. A logo or the logo? Yes? Yes, I do. Mm, listen, Emerson. Yes, I do. Eh, Emerson, Milena mm, and Pablo. What's they, the subject from? Yes, they do. Perdón. Yes, Sorry. they do. Okay, yes, they do. Very good. Yes, they do. Excellent job. Check out the, the answers, everyone. Check the answers. 
¿Tienen lo mismo? Yes. Yes, we do. Do you have the same answers? No, no. Give me a short answer. Do you have the same answers? Yes, no, we. I no, I don't. Es que usted viene llegando, Franco, por eso. No, yo, yo, yo estoy contestando por mí, no por todas. Ok. <laughs> usted viene llegando, por eso. Let's see the others. Do you have the answers, everyone? Did you copy? Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes, yes. No, no, no. Copy yes. the answers, please. Let me know when you finish and tell me just I finished. Okay, I finished. I finished. Very good, Mr. Palma. Ricardo, did you finish? Okay. Yes, yes. Yes. You finished. Very good. Nelson? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Thank you, Ricardo. Did you finish, uh, Nelson? Yes. Jennifer? Okay, good. I think everyone finished. Creo que a todos terminaron. Okay, let's continue. Now, let me put this right here. We go with the next exercise. The next exercise says, ask five classmates about their daily routines at work. Then share the information to three different classmates, okay? We are going to do this like at speed dating, okay? Very quick, this is going to be very quick. Now, what is the question that we are going to ask? What is the question that we are going to ask for asking daily routines? For example, Sylvia, do you drink coffee in your office? Yes, I do, right? But you oh, want to know, thanks. you want to know, Franco, the daily activities. So I will ask you, Franco, what do you do every day, for example? Or, okay, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, or what are some activities you do every day? Okay. Okay, for example, I do every day brush my teeth. Okay, so I will put here in the box, name, I will put here, name, Franco. Okay, activity, oh, sorry, activity here, I'm gonna put the activity, sorry. Okay, he, brushes his teeth you can write one example it's okay right now i'm going to i need to ask five people let's see angie what are some activities you do every day i i sure <laughs> is at 5 p.m. She takes a shower at 5 p.m. 5 a.m. Uh, 5 a.m. E.m. E.m. Okay, at 5 a.m. Mm -hmm. This is one activity. Ricardo, what are some activities you do every day? I, I do exercise and... 6 p.m. Exercises at p.m. At 6 p.m. Yes. Okay, 6 p.m. Okay, very good. Now, here, here in the activity, right, in the activity, we're going to put daily routines at work and at home, okay? okay. At work and at home. Tell me Nelson, what are some activities you do at work? Mm. Uh, uh -huh. I go to To motorcycle 
Okay. He I drives drive. a motorcycle. Sorry, he drives <clears throat> a motorcycle. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, okay. That's what you do at your work. Okay. Sí. Yes. Tell me something you do in your work, Aneida. Is uh, inventory. Okay. Is uh -huh, she the inventory? Uh -huh. She. 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 Uh huh. Make. Okay. She. Okay. Remember, remember she. that you are going to it's give nice. the answer. Remember, you are going to give the answer as I. I make the inventory. Uh -huh. I drive a motorcycle. I exercise. Uh -huh. I am writing the information like this because later I am going to tell hey, Claudia, Franco brushes his teeth. Uh, Claudia, Angie takes a shower at 5 a.m. Right? So I am going to say this information to other people. Okay? That's why it has to be in third person singular. Is that clear? Yeah. Yo les pregunto, si, o alguien les pregunta, ustedes van a contestar con I. Okay. Esto es para nosotros hablar de esta tercera persona. Okay. Okay. We're talking about someone else. So that's why we need to use he. To, eh, fíjate, como que fíjate que Nelson maneja una moto, right? Nelson drives a motorcycle, right? Entonces, yo estoy okay. hablando de estas personas. Okay? ¿Ok? That's for everyone. Now, please copy the example. Copy the example because you're going to do the same right now. Eneida. ¿Qué me dijo Eneida? She makes the inventory, right? The inventory. Yes. Ok. He hecho una pregunta. Yes. Y donde dice Ricardo, ahí no se podría poner he does an exercise. If he tells you that he doesn't, yes, you no, can do does, that. He does. Uh -huh. he does. No doesn't. He does. He does exercise. He does exercise. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, but it's, it's better. Ejercicio. No, pero es que... Mm, yo le voy a ser sincera, chicos. Yo no traduzco porque me cuesta. I don't, I don't translate porque mm -hmm. me confundo porque inglés y español son diferentes formas cuando se conjugan los verbos mm -hmm. y las actividades. Entonces no, con, no, no, no traduzco. Me va, me va a explotar la cabeza. Sí. Entonces acá we say he exercises or another option he works out. I'm going to work out. Right? He works, works out. out. Work out uh -huh. is when you okay. do exercise. Oh. Right? He works out, right? Another option is he goes to the gym. He goes to the gym, right? Yes. Pero sí, así como dicen por ahí, me piden que les traduzca y les quede mal, chicos. Okay. Now, please take a screenshot. Take a screenshot. Yes, teacher. Okay. ¿Ya tomaron la captura? Yes, yes teacher. Okay, very good. Now, we are going to work right now. You are going to ask five people, okay? Let's see, one, two, three. Cabalito, estamos cinco equipos, tres equipos. Tres equipos, tres equipos. Gómez Ortega. Uy, ah, Pedrina. Hello, Pedrina. Okay, we're going to make three groups. Right, we're going to be in each of the groups. We're going to be working as each person in your group, okay? As each person in your group. And then I am going to change you. Después de cinco minutos, me hayan preguntado, lo voy a cambiar de equipos, okay? Para que ustedes compartan la información. Los del equipo uno con los del equipo tres, los del tres con el dos, los del dos con el uno. Is that clear? Okay. So we have more vocabulary at the end. Okay, let's start. We have five, five, and 
four. Okay. Solo hay un equipo de cuatro. Todos están de cinco. You have five minutes to ask. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Follow the example. Follow the example. People, follow the example. Let's do it. We can do this. Pedrina, choose your group. Cinco. Cinco. Sí, cinco. Cinco. Ok. Um, you have four minutes. Yes. Um, Hello, Emerson. What do you do in the morning? You, you report. Um, and in my world uh -huh. is process production data. Okay, Emerson. You produce process production data. The, oh, hey. The process production data. What to the word? Uh, no, sé, no sé cómo se dice. Ir al trabajo. Sí. ¿A qué horas? ¿A qué horas salgo o a qué horas entro? Entra. ¿O a qué horas se va? What to the word? Uh, entro a las 8 y salgo a las 5 oh, go, go to work. You say go to work. Uh -huh. go, go, go to work. Go to work. I go to work. Ajá, no, solo go to work. Ah, go to work. Ajá, go ahora dígalo to... como gringa, como lo estaba diciendo. Go to work. Go to work. Ajá. Go to work. I go to work at 6 a.m. Ah, at 8 p.m. 8 a.m. es la cosa. 8 a.m., ajá, a.m. Or 8 in the morning. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Mr. Palma. ¿Me sale? Ajá, sobre la idea. Activities. What activities? What activities? I, activities. I, you have I, two minutes. Exercise. Two exercise. Minutes. Seven. I, um, Esa como una actividad nada más o hay que, hay que uh -huh. poner más? Solo una. Man. Solamente. Uh -huh. Ah, es, es cabal, es she check emails and answer time. Uh -huh. Ok. Y luego va Ricardo, va usted. Okay. Bueno, yo lo que hago es One minute I make reports eh, to sales <laughs> yeah. I make reports to sales Repeat Claudia, repeat. Okay. Oh, can you repeat again? Nice. Uh, repeat. Uh -huh. Repeat, please. I make reports uh, to sales. I make reports to sales. To sales, uh huh. Yes. I make reports to sales. Or yes. do you want How to say I make sales sell? reports? I make sales reports. Uh -huh. 
Así okay. escriba lo mejor. I make sales reports. Se hace reporte de venta, ¿verdad? Yes. Mm -hmm. I make sales reports. I make sales reports. Sales reports. Okay, my turn. Yes. I deliver document to other uh, company. To the to other companies. To the, to other companies. Mm -hmm. I deliver document Again. to the other. To other Again, companies. I I deliver. Uh -huh. Yes. Document to the others company. Very good. Okay. We're gonna start we're gonna be moving. Y la señorita Cla Claudia. Eh. Promote financial service. 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 Hi, Eneida. Que se me hizo Eneida. ¿Por qué se va? No, la bien sí, está es Neida, está de renuente. Yo solo veo a Claudia aquí, no veo a Francisco ni. El Neida no se quiere venir para acá y ahora te la estoy llamando. Ay, yeah. eh, no sé qué pasó, estaba en otro grupo. Yo les dije que los iba a mover. Sí, de ahí que me vine para acá, pero en el otro no sé qué pasó. Esa, ya la saqué. Movió, ajá, y ahí estoy en otra. Uh -huh. Y ahora estoy acá. Aquí, va, aquí está bien. Aquí. Okay. 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 Tenemos que compartir la información sí, sí, sí. de los otros compañeros. Ajá. Uh -huh. Hi, Nelson. Ah, hi. Ah, anda. Hi, Sandra. Yes. Hi. Eh, bueno, si gustan voy a compartir la información este, de un compañero y así sucesivamente. Uh -huh. She, okay. he, don't, remember, don't forget that. Se nos fue Nancy. Yes. Los dejó, no, porque no se apuraba. No, sí. No, sí. A cuál la ficha lo van a preguntar. No, right now you're going to provide the information. Ahorita con lo que tienen van a, a, a compartir la información, ¿ok? Ok. Teacher. Okay. Yep. Y... La verdad no me recuerdo ahorita cómo es que se hace la pregunta para preguntar. Bueno, perdón. ¿Cómo se hace la pregunta para solicitar esta información? No, ahorita solo van a compartir. Por ejemplo, vamos a decir. Hey. No entiendo nada. Ok. For example, right? I have the information of uh, Franco, right? Yo le pregunté a Franco ya en mi equipo al inicio. Le voy a decir, Franco brushes his teeth. Eso es todo. Yo voy a compartir en third person singular. He brushes his teeth. Okay. Yo también brush. ya le pregunté a Claudia. A Claudia le estuve preguntando y Claudia me dijo that she, she goes to work at 5 a.m. Okay. Nelson drives a motorcycle in his work. Eso es lo que yo le voy a compartir. 
Right? Ustedes van a compartir solamente lo que ustedes tienen de sus otros compañeros. ¿Ok? Como un chambre, vaya. Así. Okay. Fijar. <ríe> That's it. Right? Okay. That's it. Nice. Nice. Ok. Pero estamos practicando third person singular. He and she. Ok. Let's go. Yes. Thank you. Hoy sí, Franco. You're welcome, Emerson. Franco. Franco. Hi, teacher. Do you hear me? I hear you now. Did you get Bye. the answer? Hoy sí. Hoy sí. Ok. Very good. I see you in a moment, guys. You have three minutes to share. Yes. Teacher, ¿cómo se pronuncia put? About, uh, how, how do you say, how do you spell uh, that? Um, so it's the letter A, A, B, O, U, T. Oh, about. 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 Okay. Uh, sería feel busy and tell to stop about. Mm, tell me what, tell me the information again. ¿Qué quiere decir? Dígamelo en español. Que okay, hago visitas It's de campo y charlas al personal. Okay. okay. I work in the field. I work in the field. And I train the staff. Usted le da capacitación, dice, ¿verdad? I train the staff. Charlas Capacitaciones son lo mismo. I train the staff. I work in the field. Trabaja en el, en el, en el campo afuera. Ok, Nancy. Ok, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Nancy. Azalia. Igual, este. Pero ya no están compartiendo lo de ustedes, están compartiendo lo que les dijo eran sus compañeros en los otros grupos. Ahorita estamos usando he and she. Oh. Ya, no, ya no vamos a compartir lo de nosotros. Ya ahorita la, ya Nancy les va a decir lo que ella sabe del otro equipo. ¿Ok? okay. okay. No lo de ella. Entonces inicio. Lo que me dijo lo del otro equipo fue she she walk to work on the motorcycle. Okay, okay. He goes to uh, work in a motorcycle. Very good. And who is that? Nelson, right? Nelson goes to work in a motorcycle. Eso escriba. Mm -hmm. O quien se lo haya dicho. He goes to work in a motorcycle. Very good. Um, Leida, Leida dijo, quiero ver, she, she, no sé cómo se dice, dijo. Uh -huh. she, she said, she pero said. ahorita, ahorita solamente digan la acción. Así como yo se las escribí, miren la pantalla que les está compartiendo ahí, Mr. Palo. Ahí dice exactamente lo que van a decir. Sí. He brushes his teeth. She takes a shower. He, he she takes she take a shower and cook breakfast at 10 mm -hmm. a.m. 10 a.m., okay. Se fue later. Okay. Se fue. Okay, very good. Pedrina. Uh -huh. She she's a work. And she works. She works. She, she works. And ten and a and m. He goes to. No, no solamente ese era. Okay. Hasta ahí. Porque el otro es es otra respuesta. Okay. Eh, Sería la mía también, no sé. No, solo la de sus compañeros. Estamos hablando con he and she. He and she. Okay. Y si usted la comparte, okay. usted va a decir I. ¿Verdad? Ay. Pues ahorita es como la de sus compañeros con los que estuvo trabajando. Sí. Ok. Now, we're going to go back she. to the main group. 
¿Ya compartieron todos? ¿No? Yes. Yes, ok. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ok. Now, the exercise, guys, was to practice third person singular. Right? He and she. Now, I need you to write example of your sentences in the chat because I need to see how you write the verbs. Okay? Recuérdense, third person singular, los verbos tienen cambios, right? Y yo necesito ver cómo lo están escribiendo porque no les puedo ver el cuaderno desde aquí. So, I have to see how you are writing the verbs. Uh -huh. And how you're writing your sentences. So, please write your examples in the chat so I can see them. Everyone. Not only Claudia, everyone. I don't see your examples. Yeah, I see one. I see one from Claudia. Okay. She. Okay. I will start writing the feedback right here also. She checks emails. Checks. Emails, Claudia, change it, checks emails. Jennifer goes to work in her motorcycle. Jennifer goes to work, Franco. Jennifer goes to work in her motorcycle. Cuidado, Jennifer. Más está en San Salvador, ahí es bien peligroso. Yeah. Ah, Hikilisco. Oh, we're near. Un día está la vecina. Jennifer goes to work in her motorcycle. Goes to work. Change it, Franco. Goes to work. Gladys. She goes to work at ATM. Goes. Nelson delivers documents to other companies. Okay. Ricardo. Nelson delivers, delivers documents to other companies, to other companies, companies, or oh, to, to other company. Very good. Ricardo, he makes sales reports. He, <gasps> Asalia, Jose me cocina el desayuno. He cooks you breakfast. Yo nunca he visto José en mi cocina aquí. Sería bueno. Right? If you say Azalia, he cooks your breakfast, me está diciendo a mí que él me viene a cocinar el desayuno. ¿Ah? Y eso es mentira porque yo hago los huevitos en la mañana. Entonces, he cooks his breakfast. ¿Ok? Y si no los míos, he cooks his Breakfast, galán fuera. He's no comiera con los cereales. He cooks his breakfast, right? He cooks his breakfast. Leida takes a shower and cooks. Claudia, <laughs> Claudia, otra vez. Claudia cooks breakfast at 10 a.m. At 10 a.m. Very good. Uh, Ricardo, go ahead. Make your question. Eneida makes inventory. Very good. She checks emails and replies. Now, one thing, eh, I'm, yeah, go ahead, go ahead, go, 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 make your question. Eh, deliveries, deliveries termina en R, en uh -huh. no tendría que cambiar en IES por la regla, porque no es una vocal que va antes de. The thing is that 
delivery is a noun, Ricardo. I have a delivery in my door. Right? Tengo una entrega. Delivery es entrega. Deliver is the verb. Uh... ¿Mm? Delivery es el, no, el, el sustantivo, el nombre. Delivery. Okay. Ah, that's the delivery guy. Ese es el chico de las entregas. Right? And then you say deliver. Deliver is the verb. So deliver ends it in R. So we just add the S. Okay? Very okay. good. Te voy a explicar algo aquí que gracias que la niña Claudia Emerson, he process, what he process, Nancy? He process what? He process what? He process his life. He process uh, money. I don't know. As Asalia, Mr. Palma, goes to work. Goes, Asalia, goes to work. Ricardo makes sales. Okay. Franco, sales, okay. sales reports. Mira lo que lo escribe aquí. Sales okay. reports. Okay. Reports. Ah. Reports. Claudia. Ricardo. She promotes finance, finance and services. Very good. She is take. No, Asalia. She takes a shower. Recuerda que en el simple present no usamos el verbo to be. She takes a shower and cooks breakfast. Voy a explicar el ejemplo de Asalia porque les quiero explicar otra cosa. And I want you to pay attention to this. This is very important. Todo es importante, ya. Mira, ¿qué estoy diciendo? Thank you, Asalia and Claudia, for your examples. Okay. One thing we need to remember. Ay, cosa. Is that with the, uh, can you see my screen? Yes? Okay. With the simple present, right? We do not use, right? We do not use the verb be, right? So we're going to definitely uh, delete that, right? Now, remember, we are going to uh, Asalia and Claudia, they have written questions using and. Si se fijan, ellas dos han hecho buenos ejemplos escribiendo and. And es una conjunción que nos ayuda a conectar. Okay. And. And it helps us to connect similar ideas. Okay. Similar ideas. So we have, she takes a shower and cooks breakfast at 10 a.m. Now, we need to remember that we need to have the rule of S in the verbs. She takes a shower and cooks her breakfast at 10 a.m. Two things, right? We have one, one activity, takes a shower. The next activity, cooks her breakfast, right? The only problem here is the time, right? When we say the time, we are saying that she's taking a shower and cooking her breakfast at the same time. Imagínense, está bañando y se está cocinando y al mismo tiempo, right? Which is almost impossible. ¿Qué lo vamos a decir? Las dos cosas pasan in the morning. In the morning. Ahí no estamos diciendo exactamente un tiempo, pero estamos diciendo que es algo que pasa en la mañana y es una rutina. She takes a shower and cooks her breakfast when? In the morning. Right? Los dos verbos van a llevar la regla de la S. No solo el primero o no solo el segundo. Los dos. Okay? Now, when we have the verbs, also I saw here another example. That Ricardo makes a report. Ricardo makes a report. Very good. She promotes. Okay. Ricardo makes. Eneida makes. Very good. He cooks his breakfast. Jennifer goes. Okay. Now, otra cosa que tenemos. Todo, todo eso nos pasa a todos los que hablamos español. En español nosotros utilizamos bastante la el determinante de o el determinante el, 
Yo voy al trabajo. Yo voy a la escuela. ¿Verdad? Y en inglés, el determinante que es más parecido es este. Da. Right? Entonces, yo escuché a varios que decían, por ejemplo, I go, sorry. I go to the work. Right? ¿Por qué? Yo voy al trabajo. Right? Así lo están traduciendo, entonces por eso no traducimos. Porque esta solamente se va a usar, utilizar en casos especiales. En inglés ya están frases que ya están hechas. Por ejemplo, go to work, go to school, go to bed, right? go take a shower, you stink. Right? So those are phrases that are already made. So in here, tratemos de no abusar del uso de da. Okay. Porque el da se nos pega también porque en el, el, en el vocabulario salvadoreño usamos bastante el, la, el, la. Por ejemplo, decimos, ah, y la Sandra ya, ya entró. And the Sandra is here. No, right? We're not going to say that. Y el Mr. Palma ya está aquí. And the Mr. Palma, no. Right? What about Mr. Palma, right? So, is it clear? Porque varios estaban utilizando go to the work, right? And we say go to work, okay? Now, let's continue. Do you have a question about the simple present and the use of S here? Recuerden, si tenemos una actividad, acá el ejemplo de, 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 de ella hubiera estado con tiempo. Si lo queremos hacer con tiempo, she takes a shower at 9.30, for example, so, me estoy inventando los tiempos, at 9.30 a.m. and cooks her breakfast at, si, no queremos, si le queremos poner tiempo específico, at 10 a.m. Right? Ahí sí ya tendría tiempo específico. But if we want, if we don't know, y si, si solo le ponemos el a una y se lo ponemos al final estamos diciendo que las dos actividades están pasando al mismo tiempo o pasan al mismo tiempo ok, so we say in the morning in the afternoon right in the morning in the afternoon at night right at night in the middle of the day at noon, a las 12 del mediodía, right? 12 p.m., right? At noon, at midnight. Ya, yeah, dentro de un par de horas va a ser la midnight. At midnight, okay? That's more vocabulary that we can use, people, okay? Hola, por lo menos me escuchen. Yes, we can hear you. Now, questions about this? Questions? No? Take a shower at night. No questions. Very, um, um, yo escribí según lo que her. ella me dictó. Entonces... Sí, está bien, está bien. Ajá. Recuérdense que ahorita todos estamos aprendiendo. Por eso es que es bueno compartir. Pero, Put your pero escribí, escribí bien las palabras, creo, ¿verdad? Sí, sí, escribió bien las palabras. Está bien. Okay. Lo que okay. pasa es que eh, yo les tengo que decir cómo mejorar las oraciones. Y sí, recuérdese sí. Que, que como ellos también están al mismo nivel suyo, le van a decir lo que saben. No, 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 yo lo que digo es que, que sí, o sea, para mí yo me siento satisfecha porque escribí bien las palabras. Ya, yeah, es ok. Uh -huh. It's ok. Aquí sí. está bien. Se entiende que estamos teniendo two daily okay. activities. Very good, very good. Thank Now, you're welcome. Claudia, haga los cambios usted en las oraciones que usted tenía también con and, ¿ok? And, very good. Now, let's continue. And we're going, Juan Josué, hello. Hello, teacher. Ya vino. Ok. Now, I am going to show you something that helps, that is going to help us to understand, right? To understand the information of 
uh, places, okay? Places. Places is a vocabulary that we need to work with because there are many places when we are um, talking about occupations and activities at work, right? We need to work with different places. Take a look at this. And here I have more occupations, right? Can you see my screen? Yes. Okay. Now, yes. in this screen, I yes. have different occupations, right? Because before we only have a truck driver, a accountant, bookkeeper, and here we have a little bit more, right? What are we going to have? We have, and listen to the pronunciation, please. I'm going to put mute on you right now so you can listen to me. Right, listen. Le voy a poner mute a todos, por favor, para que me escuchen. No se quiten el mute para mientras, okay? We have accountant, bellhop, here, doctor, electrician, front desk clerk, nurse, office manager, painter, plumber, police officer, receptionist, person. Security guard, taxi driver, and vendor. Vendor. Okay, now I need you to please now repeat after me. We're going to start with, well, if you can, please repeat all of you at the same time because we need to practice the pronunciation. Let me make this bigger. Let me make this big. Give me a moment. Vamos a hacer más grande, lo miro muy chiquito. Oh, no, 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 no. Ok. Letter A, accountant. 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 Bellhop. 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 Cashier. 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 Doctor. 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 Electrician. 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 Front desk clear. Front desk clear. Okay. Nurse. 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 Office manager. Office, Office manager. manager. Painter. 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 Or painter. 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 Two pronunciations. Painter. 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 Plumber. 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 Listen. Plumber. 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 Okay, no, listen. Plumber. 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 La B se pierde. The letter B Plumber. is gone. Plumber. 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 Officer. 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 Police officer. Police officer. Police officer. Police officer. Police officer. Receptionist. 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 Okay. Practiquemos la R porque escucho varios receptionist. 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 Salesperson. 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 Security guard. Security guard. No, listen. Security guard. 
Security, security guard. Guard. Yeah. guard. Exactly, exactly. Guard. Security guard. Taxi driver. Taxi driver. Taxi driver. driver. Now is Uber driver. Okay. Uber, Uber driver. 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 Vendor. 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 Vendedor, chicos. Vendor is the vendor. person, salesperson, a vendedor. Okay, salesperson is a vendedor. A vendor is a person, a man or a woman that is going to fix the things in the house. For example, if the roof, the roof of the house is broken, the vendor is going to fix it. If the bathroom is not working, the vendor is going to fix it. Just un, un, un vendor es una persona que nos ayuda a, a reparar los, las cosas que se nos han arruinado en la casa. Es como, bueno, aquí en El Salvador no está su opción porque todos tenemos vendor en la casa, ¿verdad? todos los... No, no, hombres o mujeres reparamos las cosas como sea pero en Estados Unidos en Estados Unidos las personas no reparan las cosas por ellos mismos ¿okay? entonces necesitan una persona que les llegue y les arregle las cosas ok that's why they have vendors vendors si se les arruina eh, la cocina llame al vendor si se le arruina el aire acondicionado, call the vendor. If the bathroom doesn't work, call the vendor. Ok. So it's totally different. ¿Entendemos qué significa vendor? Okay. Yes. Para que no la confundamos con vendedor. Because it's not the same. Ok. It's not okay. the same. Now. <clears throat> let's see. What we're... Oh, ya le dejé de compartir. Sorry. Now. We are going to work like the following. It says, where does a doctor work? We are working with, with where. Where is for questions and is to talk about places. We have four places here. We have in a hospital, in an office, in a store, in a hotel, okay? We have four places here. So, what are we going to say? Where does a doctor work? Look at the answer. A doctor works in a doctor works in a hotel. Is that correct? Is that correct? No. In a store. Where does a doctor no. work? No, a hospital. Okay, a doctor works in a? In a hospital. In a hospital. In a hospital. Very good, in a hospital. Okay, now I can say also, where does, um, where does a receptionist work? Where does a receptionist work? She works in office. A receptionist? A receptionist works in office. Works in an office. An office. In an office. Very good. In an office. Now, this is what we're going to do. This practice is going to be right here. We can put in a hospital, nurse, in an office, in a store, in a hotel to complete the charge, right? But what I want you to do is to practice speaking right now speaking in each group okay so please yes, my teacher yes uh, está en el, en, en el libro. no this is not in the book no 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 so please take a screenshot good question take a screenshot yes okay very good take a screenshot now es que el libro nos repite lo mismo y lo mismo entonces hay que tener otro vocabulario de occupations ok no nos podemos quedar con las mismas cinco. Let's have more. Now, 
Okay. Now that you took a screenshot, before you go with the group, I am going to just call the attendance very quick. Right? Y después lo va, nos, nos vamos al grupo. It's only speaking. Okay? Only speaking. Remember the question. Where does, where does an electrician work? Where does an electrician work? Josué. 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 Hello, teacher. Where does Hello. an electrician work? No. Josué, where does an electrician work? Por estar en chambrería. <laughs> where does an electrician work? Uh -huh. Who has the answer? No. Um, no, ¿Dónde no. trabajan los electricistas? En CAE. En un office? En the house? En un hotel. Uh -huh. Ok, so what is the answer? An electrician? An electrician work. No sé. En. Ajá. Edificio. Edificio. At the building, ok. In a building. In a building. In a building. In un edificio. In a building. Very good. In a building. Very good. Ese sería un lugar muy bueno. In a building. In the company. Otro lugar, otro lugar. Anoten, anoten. In the company. In the streets. En las calles. At the restaurant. At the restaurant. En el in chat estoy hotels. poniendo. Hotel. Say it, Franco. Hotel. In en los talleres hotel. no aplicaría. Hotel. hotel. What, Neida? También. En También talleres no aplica. No aplica. Talleres. In a shop. Yeah. Ok. Esos, esos, esos lugares los pueden ocupar para cualquiera de los que estamos del de vocabulario que tenemos. Ok. No solamente para electricians. In the streets, at the restaurant, in a shop, in my house, in my house, at the pharmacy, at the pharmacy, oh, at the mall, at the mall. Okay, you have there all more vocabulary so you can talk to your classmates. Este es para la actividad que vamos a hacer. La práctica es. Speaking only. No van a copiar nada, solamente speaking. Copien ese vocabulario para que lo puedan utilizar. In the meantime, mientras copian el vocabulario del chat, yo paso lista. Ángela de Jesús Santa María. Ángela de Jesús. Present teacher. Azalia Melanie Present Guardado. Teacher. Thank you. Azalia Melanie Guardado Portillo. Present teacher. Claudia Yanez Ramos Hernández. Present teacher. David Ernesto Quintanilla Martínez. David Ernesto. Emerson Javier Rivera Rojas. Eneida Yasmín Hernández Present Cruz. Present teacher. Thank you. Present. Thank you. Francis Humberto Hernández Valle. Mm -hmm. Franco Damián Vázquez. Present teacher. Juan Josué Hernández Hernández. Present. Leida Susana Sorto. Present. Nancy María Serrano Chacón. Present teacher. Nelson Brian Pereira Maravilla. Present teacher. Norma Carolina Mata de Chévez. Present. Pedrina Iliana Gómez Ortega. Pedrina Iliana Gómez Ortega. Ok, hello Pedrina. Ricardo Gabriel Alvarenga Ventura. Como que se trae jardillita, se ¿sí? han visto la película de jardillita. <ríe> Sandra Gladys Méndez de Barahona. El tipo Alvin en la jardilla. ¿Tú? Present teacher. Hi. Jennifer Avidaí López Escoto. Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. 
Daniel Antonio García Ortez and Jose Alfonso Palma. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Ah, yo soy la que me diga sí, ya escucho. <laughs> Listen to me. No sé. Eh. Mira, no me ponga esos sonidos. <laughs> Y lo, no le quita el mío termina. Ok, te gracias. Si no, no vamos a parar de reír. Ok. Now, let's go. Practice is speaking. Remember the question. Where does an electrician work? Where does a receptionist work? Where does a doctor work? So we can practice places and we practice simple present. Ok. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We're gonna work right now. Not too many people. There are mucha gente en un grupo. Vamos a poner acá. Three people in each room. Three people. Let's go. Choose your group. Choose your group. Choose your group. Choose your group. Select your group, please. Select, select, select. Pedrina, escoja su equipo. Pregunta, ¿cómo sería? Ah, sería, where does uh, contact work? An accountant. An, what does an accountant? Accountant. An accountant. Ah, sí, porque termina ahí. What does uh -huh. an accountant? Sí, porque termina en vocal. Y el otro en consonante. Ok, ok, ok. Where does an accountant? Ajá, sería en, okay. en office. Y la respuesta sería. En office. An accountant. Sería, sería an accountant works. In, in an office. Uh -huh. in, in an office, ajá. Ok, very good. Uh -huh. Continue, Nancy. Ok. Nancy María Serrano. Ok, voy yo, ya que no parece okay. que no tiene interferencia. Where does a uh, cashier works? Uh -huh. Where does a cashier works? Ok, a cashier works in, in a supermarket. Ok, in a supermarket or in Ada, in a store too. Sí. Okay. In, in a, a store. Bank. In a bank. Very good. A veces a las cajeras del banco le dicen de otra forma. ¿Cómo se le dice a los food? Food, nada más, de comida rápida. No sería ahí también. Ajá. Como eh, el food court es el, food por court. ejemplo, el que está donde está, en, ya han ido a Metro. Ah, okay. Metro Centro. Ajá, sí. En Metro Centro hay un food court donde hay un montón de cosas de comida. Ah, pero es, donde pero nunca si usted. Ciento. No, sí, qué terrible. Me, peor mañana. Pero si usted, por ejemplo, eh, está hablando acerca de, ¿cómo se llama? De comida rápida en a fast food restaurant, ah. como, como Burger King, como Wendy's, right? como Don fast Pollo. Food right? Fast food restaurant. In a fast, in a fast, fast food, food restaurant. Fast food restaurant. Bank teller también les dicen a las cajeras del banco. Bank teller. Así. Bank teller. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok, la siguiente. Okay. Sería la Continue, continue. Yes. Okay, okay. Yes. Where does a chair? Ah, where does a 
Cashier. No, perdón. Cashier. Cashier. Very good. Cashier. Cashier. Nelson. No, pero termine la pregunta. Where does a cashier where, work? Where, where, where does a cashier where work? Does. Where does. Where does. Le voy a poner planas porque ya van varias veces que sí. me dice dos. Sí, sí. Where, where does a cashier, a cashier work? Work. Work. A cashier work. Works. In... Work. A cashier work. work. No. A cashier works. A cashier's works. Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Sabe que, una, ¿Sabe que una vez no me dieron un trabajo? Porque me, cuando empezaba a hablar inglés, no me dieron un trabajo porque no pronunciaba el final de las palabras correctamente. Ok. Entonces, Ajá, look, very good, excellent. Ajá, cashier works. In a bank. In a bank, very good, excellent. In a bank. In a bank. Ok, my uh -huh. tour. Ok, in my work, in a store, in the supermarket, at la despensa de Don Juan. Right? Yeah, many places. Right? Yeah. Ok, where does a plumber work? Eh, uh, a plumber work. ¿A plumber qué significa? No, no sé. Plomero, creo. Plomero. Uh -huh. Ah, yo, yo seré una plomera. Sí. <ríe> ok. A, a plumber. A, a plumber work. Um, um, hospital. En a hospital. 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 Yes. Okay. Okay. Ahora, yo pregunto, pregunto. Sí. Sí. Where does security guard? Where does a security guard? Sí. Nelson. No, vaya. Usted tiene que decir, where does a security guard work? No ha terminado la pregunta. Where, where does a security guard work, Nelson? A mí. A mí me está preguntando. Ah, where does uh, Uber drive work? Um, <clears throat> Uber driver, Uber driver, Uber driver, uh, Uber driver works in, in the street, in the streets. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Hey, Jose. Yes. Where does, uh, office manager work? I office manager work in uh, an office manager and office manager an office manager in a in bull bull works. Uh, what did you say? A uh, edificio. Mm -hmm. In a build build. How much building? Wood. Es un edificio, building. ¿verdad? In a building, ¿ya? Yeah. Es un edificio. Building. Yeah. Un edificio. Angie. Manager. Hello. Okay. Where uh, does uh, receptionist work? I, I, a receptionist work in in a office in an office an office in, in an office in, in an office an of, in an office in very an good. office mm -hmm. in an office very good 
Uh, Emerson. Uh, Hi. Where are these nurses at the world? Where does a nurse work? A nurse. Where are the those nurses work? Work. Uh huh. Uh, a nurse works in a hospital. Nurse works in a hospital. Okay, very good. Uh, Angie. Yes. Where does a plumber? Creo que es comprador. No no sé. El qué? Bell -hop. Bell -hop. Ah? Bell -hop. Bell -hop is a person that is going to help you with your bags when you are in a hotel. So mm. it, sometimes when you have a lot of luggage, luggage is a lot of bags, right? So there is one person, usually a man, that is going to help you with all the bags. Right? Because you say, mm, I don't want to have them. So he is going to have the bags to your room in the hotel. Okay? Es el, el que anda acarriando las maletas. El malete, el, el maletero. maletero exact. <laughs> el maletero. You're so right. Mm. Okay. okay. Yeah, entonces le voy a preguntar where does a bellhop work, Sandra? Mm -hmm. One um, more minute and we finish. Okay. In, in the hotel? In the hotel, okay, in the hotel. In the hotel. Ahora usted pregúntale a Jennifer. Ok. Eh, where, where does a cashier? You finished? Yes. Yes. Ok, so let's go. If you finish, let's go. Hello, 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 hello. <coughs> Did you finish? Yes, we finished. Now I am going to ask someone and that person is going to ask another person and another person and another person. We are not going to repeat, okay? We are not going to repeat the occupations, okay? Okay. So yeah. All the occupations are going to be different. So if I say secretary, nobody can say secretary, okay? Now, I am going Here's to start. Doctor. Okay, yeah, you can say cashier, doctor, anything else. Let's okay. wait for the let's wait for the others. Let's see, four and four sixteen. Very good. Now I have here my list, and let me ask one person. Where okay. where does a police officer work, Emerson. Where does a police officer work? Um, a police officer works in the street. In the street, very good. As Nelson. As Nelson. 
Le hago la consulta. Ask another question to Nelson. Ok. Uh -huh. Nelson. And where does uh um look at the list plumber plumber okay okay uh plumber uh works uh in in my house okay very good nelson ask leda where does uh um belt hop uh work uh bell hop a uh, work in the in a uh, in a uh, hotel in, in a hotel, hotel. very in good hotel. works repeat later works works very good now again a bell hop works in a hotel Repeat. Yes, a bellhop works in a hotel. Bellhop works in a hotel. In a hotel. Very good. Leida, ask Eneida. Eneida, where does a uh, electrician work? Electrician. Okay. Uh, electrician work. An electrician. An electrician. An electrician work in a restaurant. Okay, very good. An electrician works. Works. Again, Eneida. Works. Okay, read the complete sentence. An okay, electrician. An electrician works in a restaurant. In a restaurant, okay, very good. Remember, works, everyone, everyone, works. And Ada, ask, ask Nancy. Okay. Where does, where does a painter work, Nancy? Uy, sorry, painter. Or in the my house okay a painter works I'm in my painter. house painter. Okay. Painter. a painter works in my house very good nancy asked franco okay where where does um a doctor work okay a doctor works in a hospital pero ese ya estaba deme a otro Nancy. Qué mala. Where, where does um, office, police office. Ya estaba. Ya está. Taxi driver. Where does um, office manager. Ok. Uh -huh. ¿Qué? Where does office manager qué? The work, work. Okay. A office manager works in an office. <laughs> okay. An office manager an office. manager an, works in an okay. office. Okay. An office manager works in an office. In an office. This this place in an office is a little bit difficult because we have in an in an in an office, right? In an, in office. an office. Very an good. Office. Okay, Franco ask Sandra. Okay, Sandra. Where, where does a taxi driver work? Sandra. A taxi driver work in the strip. Very good. Now, Very Sandra, good. thank you, Franco. Now, Sandra, repeat. A taxi driver works. A taxi driver works. 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 In the street. In the street. 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 
Okay, very sí. good. Sandra, add one more person. You choose de los que ya quedan. Vamos a ver. ¿Quién va a ser el bendecido? Uh -huh. <ríe> Nancy. Nancy. No, Nancy ya pasó. Ya pasó. Es que no sé. Eh... José. Ok. Pasó? Haz José. Okay. Haz José. José. Guardas a... A Kasha. A Kasha Work. A Kashir. A Kashir Work. Kashir Work. Kashir Work. Where do you say Akashir work? Where does Akashir work? Where does Akashir work? Akashir work in... In a bank. In a bank. Okay, very huh? good. In a bank. Okay, in a bank. Okay, very good. Very good. Now, I want you to look at this, right? This is like the second part of this exercise to practice more occupations. And we are practicing WH questions. We just practice the word where, right? Where means place, okay? Where is place. Now we are going to practice the word who, okay? Can you look at the screen? It says ask and answer. Who questions about jobs? Use the words below. We have some words here. This is not in your book. Take a screenshot because it's no vocabulary. And these are activities too, okay? These are activities too. Now, we have letter A. It says, who, who wears a uniform? A police officer wears a uniform, okay? Now we're going to, we're going to ask these questions with who, okay? Let's forget about letter C. No le pongamos atención a la letra C, okay? Who, who stands all day? Who stands all day? And we have who here, who stands all day? is to be like this, a stand. A cashier. A cashier. Mm -hmm. Complete answer. A cashier. A cashier mm -hmm. stands all day. Very good. A cashier stands all day. To complete this exercise, you need the previous exercise. Para completar este ejercicio necesitan las ocupaciones anteriores. Okay? Okay. Very good. So we have who wears a uniform? A police officer wears a uniform. Next question. Next question and pay attention. Who stands all day? A cashier stands all day. A cashier, who else? Look at the look at the occupations. Who stands all day? Only a cashier? Mm. Policy? The, the receptionist. A receptionist? Mm -hmm. A receptionist what? A receptionist stands all day. It stands all day. Oops, sorry. It stands all day. It stands all day. Right? Okay. What could be another question? Make another question for me, Claudia. Make another question for me, Claudia. Who sits all day? Who sits all day? Who sits all day? That's a very good question. Who sits all day? Let's take a look at the examples in the previous slide, the previous occupations. Who sits all day? Secretary? A secretary. Is that on the list? A secretary? Mm -hmm. A secretary sits all day. All day. And from the list? Mm -hmm. 
Necesito que practiquen el nuevo vocabulario también. Secretaria está perfecto. Eh, a a taxi driver también. A taxi driver, yeah, a taxi driver sits all day. Sit all day. Okay, very good. Individually, individually, you are going to make your questions, okay? Individually, make five questions and five answers. Very easy, individually, okay? Now, these are my questions. Estas son las mías, esas no me las copien. Copien las suyas, okay? So take a screenshot, right? So you're gonna make five questions using all these activities we have. Wears a uniform, stands all day, sits all day, handles money, talks to people, works at night, works hard, makes a lot of money. A teacher makes a lot of money. No, ya quisiera yo. Hmm? Okay. A teacher works hard, for example. Now, take a screenshot. Yes. Okay. Ya estamos. Okay, individually, individually, you have two minutes. Make your five questions. Make your five questions. And once you have them, please put them on the on the chat. I want to see the questions. Let's do it. Mientras trabaja, yo le puedo tomar la asistencia para no aburrirme. pero puede dejar la captura o de, de, no le tomo volar. captura no le tomo captura sí, le tomé. cómo sí le tomé pero creo que cuando voy a buscar la imagen ese que tengo ahí. no le entendí pero creo que quiere que la ponga de nuevo lo único que ya no le va a mostrar las respuestas que hicimos, solamente la captura de la PowerPoint. ¿Ok? Yes. Ok. I will call the attendance then later because I need to see you when I'm taking the list, when I'm taking the attendance. <clears throat> Did you finish? I have five messages right now. Very good. This is here. Very good, Claudia. Excellent job. I will read the, 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 the questions. Okay. It says here. Who talks to people? Oh, Franco, don't forget the question mark. The question mark, Franco. Right. Who talks to the people? A receptionist talks all day. A receptionist talks to people. Okay, good, good. Question mark, Franco. El, 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 el signo de interrogación, si no nos pregunta. 
Who handles money? A cashier handles money. Eh, Claudia, handless or handless? Handles or handless? Who talks to the people? Ah? Yes, handles. Handles. Handles is to take care of money. Who handles money? A cashier handles money. Solo que estoy diciendo a Claudia que le puso una S de más y así significa otra cosa. Handless es que no tiene manos. Mm. Claudia. Who works at night? A taxi driver works at night. Who talks to people? A salesperson talks to people. That's true. Who handles money? A Uber driver handles money. Who makes a lot of money? Thank you, Claudia. An office manager, Emerson, an office manager makes a lot of money. Who works hard? A police officer works hard. Who works hard? A plumber works hard. Very good. Stand up today. No, Leida. Write the complete question. Leida. Who stand up all day? A security guard stand up all day. Leida. Full questions. Who handles money? The cashier handles. Ah, mira la vez, usando ya la salia, los objetivos posesivos. The cashier handles it. Very good. Who talks to people all day? A salesperson talks, and Ada talks to people all day. Talks, please. Talks to people. Okay. Vamos, chicos, vamos. Who works at night? A security guard works at night. Angela, I don't see your answers, Angela. What are your answers? Okay, teacher. Angela. Mm -hmm. Josue, I don't see your answers. What are your answers, Josue? Who works at night? Very good. Who works in a hospital all day? An accountant makes a lot of money. No, a um, nurse works in a hospital all day. Who makes a lot of money? An accountant makes a lot of money. Okay. ¿Quién me falta que escriba sus ejemplos? Abidail, I don't see your examples, Abidail. está haciendo que no es con usted, ¿verdad? Norma Carolina, your examples. Ya puse el mío, teacher. Ya puse el suyo. Ángela. Ah, sí, Sandra. Sí, vale. vale. Mm. Pedrina, in your example, Pedrina. No se haga que no es con usted. Ah, ah Sandra, I see your example, Sandra. Sandra. Yes, 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 yes. Who talks to people? A doctor talks to people. That is true. That is true. Yes, so Brian, very good. Who works at, at night? Check your spelling. Nelson, your spelling. ¿Cómo escribe las palabras? Es muy importante en inglés. Who makes a lot of money? A taxi driver makes a lot of money. Very good. Okay. Very good. Okay, very good. Who sits all day? Leida, is su, su pregunta, Leida? A security guard works at night. A cashier handles money. Very good, and, and G. Oh, all day. Very good, thank you, Franco. Franco did all the work. Claudia, too. Nelson, very good. Asalia, excellent job. And Neida, very good. And Neida? You are forgetting the S. Eso es lo único que me le falta, Eneida. Que no se olvide la tercera persona del singular. Yeah. Ok. Ya me entendió cómo van las oraciones, en qué orden van. Ahora falta okay. que se recuerde que la tercera persona lleva S. Ok. 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 Uh -huh. Ok. Very good. Who stands up all day? A security stands up today. Ok. Very good. Very good, Leida. Ya ve que sí. Okay. 
Very good. Who tells? Who tells what? Tales son cuentos, Nelson. Tales. Tales son cuentos, así como la caperucita roja. Eh, ya no me puedo otro. Ok. Let's go. Let's do another, another activity. Oh, no, 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 no. Vamos a parar aquí. Vamos a parar acá. In the activity, I am going to access right now my, and I'm sorry, I, this is not my computer, so I'm going to access the courses in my phone, okay? I am going to access the courses of English Corporativo in my phone, I think. Or let me, give me a moment. Give me a second right here. I think I have them in my in my other computer. What I want you to, to check, I am going to check right now very quick. Okay, and I will say this in Spanish because I need you to do the following. Necesito lo voy a decir en español porque esta es la segunda semana ya del curso. Esta segunda semana ustedes ya debieron haber terminado. Eh, estoy viendo la compu, no estoy viendo eh, algo más, ok. El, uh, ya debieron haber terminado eh, las 10 ta tareas, por lo menos unas 8 discusiones. Y también un examen parcial, ¿ok? Ese examen parcial está ahí en el curso. En estos momentos yo voy a ver, así, quién me hace falta a mí, ¿verdad? De que haya entregado sus actividades. Estoy accediendo a la plataforma, acá de inglés al corporativo, y vamos a ver quién hace falta, ¿ok? Así rapidito, ¿por qué? Porque yo... Hoy a las 12 de la noche, más tardar, tengo que enviar las notas. El sábado pasado, a las 5 de la tarde del sábado, habían varios que no habían enviado todas sus actividades. Entonces, en este caso, necesitamos ver acá quiénes hacen falta, ¿ok? okay. Déjenme ver. Vamos a parar acá. De la semana 1, de la semana 1, tengo acá, todos estamos bien de la semana 1. Semana 2, semana 2, Ángela de Jesús no ha completado sus actividades. No le voy a decir sus notas, sino que no ha completado sus actividades. Azalia Melanie no ha hecho ninguna. Claudia Yanet, very good job. Ya las tiene todas. David Ernesto Quintanilla no ha hecho ninguna. Emerson, very good. Emerson, si usted quiere hacer otra actividad para subir esa nota, puede hacerlo. Recuérdense que 80 es el mínimo, pero hay actividades que se las deja hacer de nuevo a la plataforma. Si usted la puede hacer de nuevo, hágala. ¿Ok? ¿Ok? Luego tenemos Eneida, Eneida Yasmín. Trabaja en la plataforma. Franco. Sí, hoy les voy a Franco, trabaja en la plataforma. Alfonso Palma, ¿puede hacer otras actividades? Falta, Todo, niño. ¿Quién mm. tiene? ¿Quién no tiene? Me faltan Bien. dos actividades, dos tareas. Bueno, José Alfonso porque... Palma. Eh, Juan Josué Hernández, please work on the platform. Vale, work on the platform. Tres le faltan, tres tareas, solo ha hecho dos. Nancy María, very good job, you're complete. Nelson, you're complete, vayas a dormir en paz. Pedrina Ileana, le faltan dos tareas. Ricardo Gabriel, vamos bien, le falta solo una tarea. Sandra Gladys, le faltan tres tareas y la mitad. ¿Y por qué la mitad? No sé, quiere decir que en una se sacó una, una, una nota baja, vuelva a la hacer. ¿Ok? Ah, no me dejó. No me dejó. A mí eso. A Silvia mí Maricela, me solo me una he hecho. Ah. ¿Cómo? En la primera semana creo que fue que no, no. me dejó terminar. Ah, ahorita estoy leyendo solo la segunda semana. Solo la segunda. Mm. Uh -huh. Solo okay. la segunda. Silvia Maricela, no. solo una he hecho. Ah, este. Vale. vale. Ajá. Yo intenté hacer las teacher 2 y no, no pude. Usted cuando le da submit, cuando usted le da submit a la tarea, 
cuando le da a entregar, ¿cómo, ¿cómo decía aquel día, Envía, José? Enviar, Entrega, enviar, enviar, ¿verdad? Cuando usted le da a enviar, enviar, si le salen todas las respuestas malas, revísela bien. Revísela que okay. las oraciones vayan con letra mayúscula al inicio. Que las oraciones okay. lleven punto al final. Que Entonces, no lleven espacio sí, después por... del que no lleven espacio después del punto. Que el apóstrofe uh -huh. sea el apóstrofe correcto. Lo que hicimos con José, porque no llevamos el, el apóstrofe en el teclado de él, es que copiamos el apóstrofe de la respuesta que ella le da, solo lo sombreamos, lo copiamos y lo pegamos en la respuesta. Si no funcionó, luego le dimos a enviar y le envió y tuvo una muy buena nota. ¿Ok? Entonces, eso podemos hacer eso si eso. el sistema le pone notas malas. ¿Ok? ¿Okay? Sí. Solo okay. malas, me las tiraba. <ríe> yeah. Era ahora, ahora les voy a leer el examen parcial. Del examen parcial, mis queridos amigos, solamente lo ha hecho Nancy María Serrano. Nancy, vuélvalo a hacer, por favor, para que sube esa nota. Ya lo hizo Nelson Bryan. Very good job. Y los demás no han hecho el examen parcial. Quiere decir que hoy en la noche... Oh, lo hizo ya también, sí, sí, solo ellos. Quiere decir que en la noche a todos les voy a poner cero y yo no les quiero poner cero. Les voy a dar hasta... Tenemos? ¿Ah? ¿Hasta qué horas tenemos? Les voy a dar, hoy es hasta las 12 de la noche, pero ya están cansados, bueno. lo van a hacer más. Le voy a dar hasta mañana al mediodía para terminar las actividades, ¿ok? Mañana al mediodía para terminarlas, yo a las dos y media las reviso Subo las notas para no ponerle cero, ¿ok? Uh, please do your activities, ¿ok? Do your activities. Si tienen alguna pregunta, mándenme un WhatsApp antes de las nueve, okay. si se puede, porque a las no, de nueve a doce voy a estar ocupada, pero antes de las nueve si me lo mandan, yo se los respondo, ¿ok? Ok. Now, Now ¿Ah? let me... ¿Ah, qué? También está allí mismo, en las actividades. Sí. ¿Cómo me dijo? No lo entendí. Que allí mismo están los el examen. Sí, de cuando usted termine toda la semana, le va a tirar los exámenes. Ah, aparece. Uh -huh. Sí, ahí le aparece. Ya le voy a mostrar acá. No sé si lo van a poder ver ustedes. Pero me denme dos minutos, porque también les tengo que pasar la asistencia. Ta, 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 ta. ¿Dónde estamos? Estamos en la unidad 2, ¿verdad? Cuando ustedes van acá, en la unidad 2, y acá terminan ya la tarea número 10, cuando ustedes ya terminan la tarea, uy, creo que no lo mira. Cuando ya terminan la tarea número 10, le van a dar next, y cuando ustedes uh, le dan okay. aquí, donde dice next o siguiente, ya les va a tirar el parcial. Donde dice parte 1, acá, Parte 1, parte bla, bla, bla. Ese ya es el parcial. El parcial tiene cuatro partes. ¿Verdad? Ah, Entonces, cuando otro. usted tiene cuatro partes, le da a entregar. Y de ahí le va a tirar la otra parte. ¿Ok? Si ya no le tira más, es que ese es el parcial okay. completo. ¿Ok? Este que ve. Sí, son cuatro. Okay, cuatro teacher. partes. Parte 1, 2, 3 y 4. Para que ustedes completen. Así que tienen que enviarlo porque hoy es el segundo curso. Es de segunda semana. Hay para que la se las actividades para poder hacerlo. Sí, correcto. Para la semana 4, el examen final debe estar hecho el jueves, porque el viernes se suben notas. La y ese día ya no. La otra. De la, sí, la siguiente es la tercera. La ¿Verdad? Oficial. Pero la cuarta semana, usted tiene que terminar por lo menos el jueves, porque ya el viernes, ya no, ya después de la clase, ya hemos subido notas y ya se fue. Así como está, ya no va a haber sábado que valga. ¿Ok? Yo, yo pensé que yo pensé que tenía que como terminar las clases como para hacer las tareas, por eso, pero si es que así tenemos ¿Cómo? que adelantarnos. No, es que la semana 4 ya... No, que después de la... No, la semana 4, Ángela, ya es como una, una práctica de lo que hemos aprendido. No es que vaya a haber algo... Algo totalmente nuevo, así, wow, no. Okay. no sí, me sí, me practicando. de la clase de ahora, me imagino. Es lo mismo, simple present. Okay, simple okay. present. Y ahora yo les di vocabulario nuevo, que no está en el libro. 
¿Ok? Ok. Ajá. Okay. Entonces no lo, no lo van a ver ahí. Entonces, déjenme pasar la asistencia rapidito. No me den excusa que yo sé que pueden hacer para la tarea. Ya van. Sí, porque ya me voy. Parecen mis niños de tercer grado de la mañana. Ok. Ángela, Jesús, Santa María. Sí, tienen hasta mañana al mediodía. Ángela, Gracias, Jesús, Santa teacher. María. A Salia, Presente, Melanie, teacher. Guardado Portillo. Presente. Claudia, Chenet Ramos Hernández. Presente, teacher. David Ernesto Quintanilla. Emerson Javier Rivera Rojas. Present. Eneida Yasmín Hernández Cruz. Present. Francis Humberto Hernández Calle. Francis Humberto. Franco Damián Vázquez. Present, teacher. Juan Josué Hernández Hernández. Good night. Present, Ella teacher. Susana Sorto. Present. Nancy María Serrano Chacón. Nancy María Serrano Chacón. Present. Okay. Nelson Brian Pereira Maravilla. Present, teacher. Norma Carolina Mata de Chévez. Present. Pedrina Iliana Gómez Ortega. Present, teacher. Ricardo Gabriel Alvarenga Ventura. Sandra, Ricardo Gabriel, se fue, ¿verdad? Sandra Gladys Méndez de Barahona. Present, teacher. Very good. So, guys, we're going to finish here. Please do okay. your homework, and I see you guys Monday at 8 p.m. Have a beautiful night. Bye-bye. Okay, thank you. Okay. You're welcome. Bye. 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 Bye.